Hello, today I'm working on an HP 14-CE series laptop. This is the 14-CE0596SA. Uh, the sub model number is TPN Q207. This computer works well except its webcam. The webcam is detected by Windows and the applications that use the webcam, so Zoom and the camera app. They think that the webcam is running and working normally, but it displays a black image. So the, the webcam circuitry, the, the USB side of it is all fine, but the webcam itself is not converting light into signal. So the webcam needs to be replaced. So on this particular model, I should be able to do that by just removing the bezel and unplugging the webcam and replacing it. I had this bezel open a little bit earlier, so I'm going to get the tool under there. I left a little bit of it exposed here. Um, to do this, to get a tool under this bezel was a little bit tricky because it's got double-sided tape on both sides holding it down. There was a little gap that allowed me to get my thin spatula in though, and so really that's all you have to do is just find a spot where you can get a tool under this plastic here. So there you can see that the tool, actually I got my fingernail to pull this back a little bit and fit this tool in there. And I have to be careful because I'm not replacing this LCD panel, so obviously I don't want to scratch it. But once this is in, I can turn it a little bit and this bezel just pops open. And there are clips at the top that hold it in, but you can work these clips. I'll put my tool in there a little bit and twist. Hmm. Just being very careful not to break any clips. So there's also tape in here, which complicates things. In some places, there's double-sided tape holding things down. All right, so now I've, I've exposed the webcam. I don't want to bend this bezel, though, but I need to be able to get to the plug. So here's the replacement part. Looks the same. This is a used replacement. Actually, it's not exactly the same because HP put two different types of webcams in these models. One has a single connector on one side. The other has two connectors, one on each side because there's basically two cameras. One, one is a normal webcam and the other is an infrared camera. This looks like it's the infrared camera, which is a shame because it would be good to be able to, to use that, but this computer doesn't have the cable or the support for the infrared camera. Maybe it does have the support, but it doesn't have the cable, so it's not going to matter. Right. This plug looks like it just pulls out. Looking at the new one, I can see that the plug just pulls outward. So I'm going to move this camera down closer. And try to get this unplugged without removing the LCD panel. Because that is literally the last thing I want to do right now. I wonder if I can lift this camera out, if that'll help me with the plug. Because it is, it's just taped in, stuck in with double-sided tape. I don't want to pull on that plug too much. Hmm. It's really stuck in there. There we go. Alright, no problem. Uh, you can't really see that. I'm struggling to get a grip on this plug, on the plastic of the plug and not just the cable. Can't really tell if it's, it's not plugged in very far. Hmm. I think I should turn this on and check that it's working before I put it back together. All right, look at that, we have an image. That's great. Just gonna, just gonna tuck that wire back in and lay this in approximately where I think it needs to be. I'm gonna check it against the bezel, make sure. Yeah, that is in the right place. All right, so that was actually quite a straightforward repair. Looks like it's working just fine. All right, so that's that. Thanks for watching.
forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.